हेलो डियर फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू शो मे नाथ यूट्यूब चैनल टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस समथिंग व्हिच हैज बीन लॉन्ग अवेटेड बाय द स्टूडेंट्स नाउ लेट्स मूव फॉरवर्ड सी दो स्टूडेंट्स हु आर स्टडीइंग अंडर मकाउत मौलाना अबुल कलाम आजाद यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी and these students there are few group a few cluster of students who are suffering from anxiety agony pain uh, and uh, more of a displeasure and the main reason is not getting their results so let's start with uh, the session today now what are the probable reasons for unpublished result of different streams of odd semester 2019-2020 mind it except those streams which have got result i'm not talking about b tech i'm not talking about b arc even b tech there are few streams which still few semester who haven't got their results yet so let's move forward Today is the first time I put a disclaimer over it. This video is for information only and completely based on situational facts and assumptions. Owner of this channel is not responsible in any way. Why I am putting this? Because now university is in a lockdown situation, and the facts which I analyzed. and from different sources which i have collected and the data analysis etc and my 14 years of uh, examiner ad hand examiner's exam experience i'm sharing it with you i hope i'll be able to satisfy at least your mental peace so let's move forward see this is the last stage or the phase uh, before this uh, uh, phase 4 results were out which means that this is the phase 3 result uh, where university published in it uh, in its uh, website that there are uh, like you know b farm uh, like you know third semester fifth semester as well as you know the different you see blanks over there specifically mba first semester and you know third semester results were missing completely still it's not there and many of the you know both undergraduate and masters level students are suffering even mba part time uh, you know only third semester result were there though they are having six semesters so third semester result is published as well as fifth semester and first semester result for part time mba is missing and for full time mba it's very amazing that their first semester results were there but third semester results those students who are uh, in the verge of completion which means right now they are in their fourth semesters and they yet to join industry uh, their result is not yet published now we'll let us discuss what are the reasons behind it probable reasons now we can see uh, that uh, in case of uh, you know bsc uh, molecular biology yeah, as well as uh, like you know this uh, bba entrepreneurship and you can take lots of mtech courses as well as ame courses where as well as msc courses mca courses their results were not there and even this is happening first semester result were out third semester result missing fifth semester result is missing or maybe fifth semester result is there first semester result as well as third semester result is missing so what we are trying to find out today what are the reasons so let's move towards the next uh, slide now this is the notice uh, prior to this you know uh, when when this uh, lockdown situation arises 
दिस यूनिवर्सिटी मौलाना अबुल कलाम आजाद यूनिवर्सिटी दे इशूड अ सर्कुलर दैट कॉन्सिक्वेंट अपन द प्रेस रिलीज ऑफ ऑनरेबल चीफ मिनिस्टर एंड दिस इज डेटेड इन दिस इज द डेट वेर फोर्टीन ऑफ दिस मार्च टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी लेटर दे अनाउंस अनादर वन सो दिस वन टॉक्स अबाउट द टिल यू नो सिक्सटीन मार्च देन दे एक्सटेंडेड टू द मैं सिक्सटीन टू थर्टी फर्स्ट मार्च 2020 entirely university has been entirely shut down uh, next day issued another letter and where it is mentioned that till 14th uh, there will be uh, online classes only and university will completely shut down and shut down in the sense of very few people will work there uh, physically and most of the people will work from home so what we are also doing and this weekly activity this mar for lockdown activities etc etc we are there so this is not our uh, you know today's topic of discussion so let's move towards the next part that is many many students have got frustrated when this this lockdown period there is announcement which uh, uh, i mean uh, this publication with there in the website like odd semester 1920 university in house department phase 4 results were come out and you know many of started believing that yes uh, they are giving macaut is giving preference to the in house students and uh, those students were studying in different other colleges so they uh, don't they are not getting any kind of priority but let me tell you this this is not the situation and why it is not the situation let me show you this also like this is the circular which has been passed to the in house students dated 30th of march 2020 uh, this is macau right so uh, this notification also uh, let me zoom it like it is notified for information all the students directors heads of in house department of macau see that the odd semester 2019-20 result first and third semester of ug and pg courses are published on 13th march 2020 now you decide that undergraduate courses are like in a btech biotechnology molecular biology they are of four years duration so first semester and third semester what about the others what about the rest what about the fifth semester what about the seventh semester they are completely missing so in house students are also getting you know not getting any kind of information regarding this so those students who are studying for, uh, in different colleges as well as the different institutions uh, you people please stop thinking about it like you people are neglected no it's not like that macau is only uh, you know uh, passing the results to the students those uh, i mean those papers were actually completed means evaluation has already been done and you know pg courses is the same thing applicable pg courses you know most of the students in mtech students they, i have shown you that that in house apart from in house department there are many other courses in, in even in house department like you know you no know, uh, like you know civil mechanical there are students who haven't received their results yet so this is something which you need to keep in your mind that please you people are not at all neglected by the macau now the same thing in this any case of uh, in completeness or discrepancy is there so they need to uh, contact uh, after 15th april 2020 so this is the first reason i'm giving you the first reason that macau is not neglecting anyone but because of certain reason and the reason is incompleteness in checking or evaluation of the papers whatever the papers were evaluated they started distributing it to satisfy the mindset of the students and they don't want to put and if you haven't got your result yet don't please don't feel neglected it's my request as a teacher as a mentor uh, of a 
uh, college as well as association as uh, head examiner with the university and the board members for a very long time so please do not feel neglected it's my request to all of you with my folded hands now let's move forward now this is another part that is the digital evaluation system this digital evaluation system now this this is digital evaluation system is for the benefit of the students and this evaluation system is really very nice helpful but you know when some system started if you start a new system if you develop a new coding like uh, there might possibility at least 0.1 percent possibility or maybe 0.01 percent possibility of a bit of system error right so what is happening over here let's see i can show you over here like uh, this is maximum allotted this is a 50000 low located answer scripts 20 and evaluated answer scripts 19 and pending answer script 1 now this system is having only one way that is it selects at least five papers and this five papers they will allocate let me show you in the next part this is this is this is what this digital one like you know if you choose select this like so you will get and allocate you will get only five papers to evaluate now what happened okay if let me go to the previous slide if a single paper is pending that means it will remain in the pool and the result will detain so that means university is not taking any more risk previously when they published the result of btech and all they rectify this but somehow this error because of this lockdown situation those system engineers who are working over there day and night they are also human beings we have to consider that and this system error maybe four pending papers so this four pending papers this happened with me also you know in a particular stream i'm not going to take the name of that but in a particular stream those four papers were remaining and i am trying to you know allocate those paper to my uh, email to my dvs system for several times almost like 50 times i tried but i failed so the evaluation of those four papers was not possible by me as a result what happened the result has been withheld until and unless the total system generates the each i mean evaluate each and every student's result it is not going to publish but now there is a hope hope of what since the lockdown situation may increase maybe uh, it is still 30th of april you people need not to worry because only one reason you are going to get error free let me tell you you i repeat you are going to get error free result and this error free result definitely will increase your sgpa so for getting something good you have to wait right so please it's my request to all the students who haven't got their results yet it is for your own benefits dear students that you are not getting result because university if publish the results many of the students are going to get incomplete or f so that is not the responsibility university never want to put any incomplete so as a result what happened okay university is now acting very sensibly and though it is taking a little bit of time please wait it is request from my side please wait and you will get your result very soon and correct result no error will be there and it will definitely increase your sgpa
and this crisis will be over and one more thing i would like to add that these all are probable situations assumptions and based on because the university is now closed so this is something which is completely based on assumption so coronavirus is taking a toll on us and uh, i would like to ask you people stay at home stay safe and save yourself save your family save the human kind all the very best have patience it will pay you if you like my channel subscribe share like and comment and i'll try to give you answer as soon as possible thank you thank you very much because time is money and if you want right information and in right time you should subscribe my channel and press the bell icon thank you thank you very much